This is uh, Joe Reviews doing a, another review of uh, another product. This product is 23andMe. So 23andMe is a DNA test used for, in this case, health or an ancestry. This is the I think $200 version. There's a $100 version that just has ancestry. Um, so, but this is the $200 version. Uh, I've done this before for other people in my family. Today I'm doing it for my wife. Uh, so this over here uh, is a kit you would get in the mail, and when you get it, you just saran wrap around it that I took off already, uh, and now you try to open it. Uh, try the key word. Um, here we go. This box that it comes in, don't break, don't rip, because it has the, the label that actually goes back to 23andMe uh, after you're done. So you get the box, you open it up like this, it has this card on it. And how to get started um, and uh, um, part of this is includes going in order to use this before doing any saliva or anything else you actually have to register this so, so in order to register it you have to go to 23me.com slash start it asks you a few questions about yourself then it brings you to a page that looks like this that asks you to enter your barcode in so I'll do that right now for this barcode okay and all the instructions you'll find are right here, okay? So things not to do beforehand or afterwards, no food or drink within 30 minutes. You have to, there's, there's a fill line that we'll have to fill to as far as saliva is concerned, then we have to shake it and send it in. So I'll show you all these different pieces here. So the first thing is the barcode, okay? So the barcode number is over here, okay? So I'm going to type this barcode number in right on here. Um, in my case, because I'm registered on this particular account, uh, I will add my wife in addition to myself on the account. Um, and um, which I'm doing right now. Uh, this takes just a second. So I leave the barcode piece. Um, the other thing it tells you also to do when you do this, when you register, in addition to that, you also write your barcode over here. So I have a pen and I have the barcode at the end. I will write my barcode on here. Next step, after uh, doing that, I'm gonna let my wife spit into uh, this thing. So here's the fill line, if you see this fill line. You can just spit in there up to that fill, fill line. So while she's doing that, I'll tell you the next step. So after she finishes that, there, I close the funnel at the top of it, and then there's this little thing over here that you, I use to uh, seal the clothes. It will then go in this bag, and wow, and uh, it gets shipped back to uh, 23andMe. So it's uh, fill line. Okay, get the fill line. Close it like this. Uh, looks like some liquid goes inside from the thing. You shake it, I guess. Um, I'm assuming. And then you take off this cap. And you put it on this cap for the mail. Okay. So this over here goes into the bag. Gets sealed in the bag and goes back in the box. Okay, and then gets shipped back to 23andMe. So let me talk to you about what happens afterwards. So uh, afterwards, as I said, I already have a 23andMe account that I've already done for myself. Um, and after you finish, and a few weeks pass, or a month passes, or two months passes, they send you the res results by email. And what they do is that they send you, uh, it, it, they, they let you know it's completed. And then you actually get a screen that looks like this that you log into. In my case, I have both the, the health and the uh, DNA um, uh, uh, ancestry pieces. Um, so in my case, it says that I have uh, 1,258 uh, relatives that it found. It also has other information provided, such as carrier status, about things that you might uh, be a carrier of or not, uh, health risks that you might have that uh, you can opt into. 
um, there are different traits. So, for example, when you eat certain things, is it uh, salty or sour or other things like that? So it talks about that. Uh, wellness uh, traits. Uh, and then it also allows you to share um, information with other people. For example, let's say I have ancestry uh, information that I want to share with somebody else who looks like they're related. I can do that. There's also surveys that they ask you if you want to complete, and that helps them, I assume, find out more information on people with my particular DNA, how if they have uh, the colorblind as an example, things like that. So uh, I, I have multiple people in my family that are on this account. It has, uh, um, I, I really enjoy it. It's helped me find uh, quite a few relatives of, of mine. Not everybody in the family finds relatives. I'll tell you, there, there are people who, who in the family who've done this who have found no relatives, but in my case, I have found relatives who have done this. Um, so uh, as far as the review is concerned, I, I, I use this. I get reports all the time from 23andMe or emails all the time saying you found another relative or multiple relatives of yours, and I go back in and look and see whether or not it's somebody I want to connect with or somebody who looks like they might be a close relative. So um, that's a short review of uh, the uh, 23andMe uh, DNA test for uh, health and ancestry. Uh, because, um, on, uh, just so you know, with, with 23andMe, right now I know they have a promotion where if uh, you sign up for 23 and excuse me, if you sign somebody else up for 23andMe and you have an uh, account, you also can get, a, I think, an Amazon gift card of $20. Uh, for those that uh, are watching this video, if uh, you have nobody who's referring you, if you were, if you were interested in uh, me referring you, just send me an email and I'll be more than happy to send you a link uh, for myself. Uh, which gets me the $20 Amazon gift card, which would be nice. Um, but again, you can do this for yourself also. Um, please uh, uh, select like on, the, on this video. And uh, this is uh, Joe Review signing off. Thank you.